Hi, Isabel. Yeah, cold and winter viruses right around the corner, except this year we have a couple new tools for our protection. The FDA just approved the RSV vaccine for pregnant women, but we have to wait for the CDC to sign off, so it will likely be available by late October. It's approved for pregnant women at 32 to 36 weeks, and it provides RSV antibodies to babies who need them in the first three months of life when they're most at risk. But all pregnant women shouldn't forget about the old standard flu shot. When we are pregnant and we get infected with the flu, we, are, we have a higher chance of getting very sick with the flu, increased risk of having um, flu-related um, complications and hospitalization. High fevers are known to affect mothers and babies. So not only is the mother sick, that high fever can also affect the unborn child. Now, the flu shot and the COVID vaccine can be given at the same time in pregnant women. Updated COVID vaccines that should give protection to the newer variants circulating should be available in late September, early October. And the RSV vaccine is also now available for adults over age 60. And there is a new RSV vaccine just approved last July or this past month called Bayfortis. It's approved for newborns up to age two who are vulnerable to severe infection, meaning premature babies or those with congenital heart or lung problems. Talk to your child's pediatrician for more information on that one, Isabel. All right, and Monica, how effective is this RSV shot for pregnant women? Well, in the clinical trials of 7,400 participants, the drug named Abrisvo lowered the risk of severe disease in, from RSV in infants by 82% in the first three months, and then that lowered to 69% by the first six months. All right, significant results there, Monica. Thank you.